I should ask you, are you okay with me just completely destroying this? And she's bitten me on the ankle. She scares me, I will be honest. Uh oh, you wanna bring it out? Bring it out, Lola. I'm so fucking scared. Careful now. Today's content is brought to you by Curiosity Stream, so big thank you to them. We live in an age where everything we consume has really transitioned to streaming and sometimes it can be really hard to keep up with multiple platforms. There's so many streaming services out there right now and if you add them all together, they're asking for hundreds of dollars a year. That's what makes Curiosity Streams $20 annual plan such a crazy good deal. If you're an animal lover like me, you'll definitely appreciate all the educational content surrounding animals that Curiosity Stream offers. I personally loved the show The Secret Life of Dogs. Now I just need them to come out with a version for bunnies, but I can wait. There's tons of great content in the meantime and all for such a great deal. Thousands of documentaries and nonfiction TV shows with new content dropping each week for such an affordable price. So go ahead and check out Curiosity Stream. And thanks to them, if you've watched this video, you get one month free using the code Len and the Bunny. On today's episode of House Rabbit Makeovers, I'm just around the corner from our nation's capital of Washington, D.C., in Northern Virginia, where a young girl and her family are having trouble with their aggressive rabbit. So, David. Uh huh. Did you watch my makeover in London? <clears throat> what? Is it? It's like out now. Yes, it's been out. What do, What do the comments say? Do they like this camera person <laughs> better than me? <laughs> do you feel betrayed and cheated on? Mm, no. No. I feel good. You feel good? Oh, okay. All right. So you well, don't You don't want to be part of it anymore. That's fine. I just want to see if the comment section, if they like this person as much as they like me. Okay. Did she do a good job? They're probably going to watch the video. Do you think I do a good job? I, most of the time, no. <laughs> Maybe we should ask them what they thought about the substitute makeover aid. I think, I think you're a little hurt. Maybe a little but bit. you don't want you don't want to admit it. Well, I had no choice. You have a lot you of pride. You had no choice. I wasn't in the UK. You, so. you have a lot of pride. You want to admit it. It's not cheating if you're in a different country. Oh, okay. But it's cheating if we're in the same country. If if you got another makeover partner in LA, I would I would knock some doors down. Like, I feel like David used to text me guys like before the makeovers ever happened, and like now he's like. He thinks he's like better than me. So oh, he like he doesn't on. ever text at all. I'm always the one who's texting him. This is a bunch of poo. I texted you the other I invited you out to my friend's birthday party. That was literally the one one time out of like in the past twelve months that you've remotely done anything like that. And you were like, no, I don't wanna go. I'm tired. I was, man, because unlike you, I actually work. <laughs> I work, what are you talking about? I feel like I'm a bad highway driver. Why? Because, um, I feel like people take highways more seriously here. You know? Like they're driving to work and stuff. But in LA, it's just like a bunch of actors driving to auditions. So there's, like <laughs> a, there's like a different vibe, you know? Oh yeah. Out here, it's like, Move out of the way! I gotta get to my children! <laughs> I'm excited. Are you excited? Turn right. Turn right. Why are you right. telling me to... Okay, what is this? I, now it's telling me to turn right. Wait, it's oh, no, been, it's okay. we're, we're all working nice on holidays together. Yeah. Yeah. It's really nice to meet you. I love your videos. Oh, thank <laughs> you. I am allergic to cats. Oh, oh sorry. Those are some big cats. 
Yeah, he's a he's fatty. Very heavy. <laughs> Nice to meet you. What is your name? Alyssa. Alyssa. Meet you, Alyssa. Nice to meet you. So talk to me about everything. Like, how long have you had the bunny? What are the issues you have with her? And like, what you want out of this? It'll be three years next October. Um, I got her when she was one years old. Uh, when we first got her, she was really nice, really sweet. The issue started after she got neutered or spayed. I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know the correct term for it. The female rabbit. Um, she just started being more aggressive, um, biting a lot. I do have scars from her biting. Um, Are you serious? Yeah. Where? I have one right here. That's <gasps> the newest one that yeah. happened a couple oh my God. weeks ago. It has been in me on my chin, my nose. Um, the first bite she ever bit me on was my finger um, when I gave her an orange for the first time. It was really long ago. She's gotten better through me having her and me trying different things. What I want out of this is just her being nicer and learning new things. I would love to change her setup in my room. Um, I, if, we, if we can, get rid of her cage and just make it more open mm -hmm. for her. Okay, and what about you? Um. So I don't live here anymore, so I don't really experience anything firsthand, yeah. but when I did live here uh, and she would be out running for her like normal playtime, she would charge at me. She actually did it this morning when she was out here earlier. Yeah. Uh, she's bitten me too when I've given her food. She's bitten me on the hand. She's bitten me on the ankle. She scares me, I will be honest. Really? Yeah. A little bunny scares you. Yes. <laughs> and I've, I've been bitten by dogs before and I'm not afraid of dogs. It's just... She's the only bunny I've really ever come in contact with. This will be interesting. I don't think I've dealt with a situation like this. Now I'm scared of the <laughs> bunny. I'm like, I don't know if I want to get bitten. Okay. So we're in Washington, D.C., and I'm going to deal with an aggressive bunny. It's different. <laughs> Let's go see this bunny. This is, like, pretty straightforward. I feel like I'm just getting straight to the point. <laughs> okay. All right, so this should be interesting. Um, so you built this yourself? Yes, me and my dad built it. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna say anything because last time everyone said I was so mean. I honestly want your honest opinion. Yeah, be mean to you. Do? Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. You, you people hear this? <laughs> people email me to come to their homes and then they complain. <laughs> no, the like, I, I get that, but like, if I want a better relationship and a better setup, I would love your honest opinion. Because it just makes it better for her and me and my family. Because when I'm gone, when I go to my dad's house or anywhere, like if I have to babysit for my cousins, my mom and my sister don't like her so much. She doesn't really get affection. Mm -hmm. And it just hurts me because they're so scared of her. And when I get home, I feel like that's her aggressive too because she's been alone and she doesn't have that love with her. Yeah. So just being here and helping yeah. is better than not getting the honest opinion that would help most. That's the first time someone's told me that. Um, okay, well, I will be honest with you then. So, I actually really appreciate that you've made the effort to give her three levels. Because horizontally, this is not a lot of space, right? But vertically, you gave her three levels, which gives her a little bit of exercise room. I'm gonna be honest with you, this is, um, this is, <laughs> that was really loud. <laughs> <laughs> that was the bed. I'm gonna be honest with you, this is, this is still, uh, it's just not enough space. Yeah. You know, there's really not anything bad I can say in terms of the structure itself. I like that you've provided her with a lot of non-treated wood to chew. I see she's chewed a lot of this. Oh, hello. I really like that you've given her food bowls and a water bowl. That's great. She's not on a water bottle. I know that, I see that she has a litter box. Is that alfalfa hay? It is. Um, that's the first time I got alfalfa hay. Um, okay. I usually get her Timothy hay. Uh, that's the brand I always usually get. I have no clue why I got alfalfa hay. Alfalfa hay has a lot of calcium. 
it doesn't have that much fiber. Uh, Adult rabbits need fiber right. to be able to use the bathroom. That's really not good for the diet part of it. And I don't see any litter. Do you use litter at all? I don't. I personally don't like it. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know why. I should ask you, are you okay with me just completely destroying this? Yes. Really? Yes. I, I, I built it. My dad built it, but I've grown to not like it. Uh, it's becoming more of a hassle. Um, so yeah, I'm completely okay with that. This is the easiest episode <laughs> I've ever done. Okay. Yeah, usually people kind of fight me on it, but that's good. You have a really cute rabbit. He kind of looks like Lennon. <laughs> that would be awful if I was bit. Oh my God. I'm going to be so sad if I'm bitten. And I probably smell like dogs too because my mom has dogs. I'm so nervous. Oh, you wanna bring it out? Bring it out, Lord Lot. Make sure it doesn't charge you. Hey, what's up, dude? You're free. <gasps> Hi. Oh. Hi. I'm so fucking <laughs> scared. Careful now. I'm like terrified after what they've said that it's a biter. Did kind of just lunge at you. Oh! Oh, sh gotcha. Yeah, I'm fine. Did she bite you? No, but she was very close to it. <laughs> oh. So yeah, that I can see what you mean by that. Yeah, and it's a little scary. I don't think you have an aggressive bunny. I think that she could be a little aggressive because of the situation she's in. And I know you mentioned to me earlier that you said she was alone a lot. Yeah. A lot of people are gonna watch this episode and they're gonna tell you the same thing that I'm gonna tell you. And I've never done an episode where I've talked about a partner for the bunny. Usually getting a partner for the bunny helps with aggression because they just they have each other to keep each right. other busy and be affectionate with one another and you know you said it's not really an option right now but it's something i would really consider for the future and i know i get a lot of crap for keeping lennon alone but that's not what this video is about <laughs> and i'd also like to point out I, i'm at home all day like i literally work from right. home but if someone's not home at all ever i would feel really sorry for that bunny mm -hmm. yeah so let's how do we do this you tell me. I think we need with the grids, but we go to the wood and we just like do that and like destroy it. Would you want to do that? Yeah. Office okay. space style. Oh my god, let's do it. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, I'm fine with that. Okay. I would love it. Oh my <laughs> god, she's like open to everything. I love it. I told. It's funny because I even told my mom that she's probably gonna get rid of the cage. I'm gonna say okay to that. <laughs> Don't be upset if she's not in a cage anymore. It's so much better when the parents aren't here, I think. I think we need to do more episodes where there's no parents. Okay, let's get scissors and get going on this. Okay, here you are. Another bunny can be in it. It's like rug is completely disintegrated. It's like super gross. 
Yeah. There is my cousin and then her friend here. Oh, okay. Um, They're having a sleepover and I'm... Yes. Okay. I don't know how that's going to work. We don't have to get them on okay, camera. Okay, just telling you because yeah. like, they're out there and then my uncle... He's not okay. He's not before him, but there's people. <laughs> <laughs> wow, bro. <laughs> She's hilarious. Like, let's do another episode. Of this. He's not important. Why is this weirdly lighter? She's eating a lot of it. <laughs> you know how that's She has eaten a lot of it. I'm right? the middle person, like <laughs> pretending to do something. <laughs> so if I fall, I'm gonna be really mad at you. I'm going backwards. <laughs> I, uh, help out? B, come on. I slide it. Yeah, you know what? Oh, yeah, maybe we should slide. Slide it down. Maybe we could just do that. Always like, 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 on the grass or just like here, throw it on the grass? Come, come back here. That way people don't think we're gonna like it. Yeah, we should do it on the grass. Okay, let's do it on the grass. Mm -hmm. Oh, not here. This is the What if someone calls the cops? Like, there's some angry ladies outside. <laughs> this is for all the ex boyfriends. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> to those who were like, oh, why aren't you going to donate the cage? Because I don't want another bunny to wind up in a cage. We're going to stop the cycle. And we're going to destroy this. Oh, it's a mallet. Cute. All right. <laughs> I'll go first. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> there you go. Oh my god. <laughs> Channel that anger. There you go. <laughs> this is gonna be a hilarious episode, David. I wanna get in there. Every guy that you had a crush on and was mean to you, just do this. <laughs> You know what makes me angry? What makes you angry, David? Like when I think I charged my phone and then I wake up in the morning and I, I realize I didn't charge my so phone. Bad. That's a bad feeling. This is cathartic. It oh, is. Get You're it like, out. I want to do it. I do want to do what it. What makes me angry? <laughs> when I give you apathetic responses via when text messages. When I don't make messages. that much money, that makes me angry. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Yeah, get in there! Um, what makes you angry? What makes me angry is when someone hurts an animal or abuses an animal. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. What makes me angry? Oh. What, what makes me angry? When someone flakes. <laughs> nice one. When someone flakes. Just like how you flaked on hitting that just now. Oh, you know what? That's a good one. You know what makes me angry? When people abuse and treat rabbits like crap. Yes. <laughs> you know, this is for anyone that has ever abused a rabbit. Watch, I missed this one. <laughs> <laughs> now I don't want to promote violence. Like, what if I'm promoting? You'll be like special, at, special bloopers at the end. Say no to cages. <laughs> Alright, that was good. Yes. Good job, B. Well done. Luke, can I keep your mallet? You call your uncle by his first name? You don't say Uncle Luke? I know. Our whole family <laughs> so disrespectful. You just never learn that way. It's This is a great experience. Like, just you out here and like, I love it. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is the best. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys are really well illuminated. <laughs> Need bright lights.
like you're like in a state of shock. Like no, just, I just like, feel bad because like I, I appreciate it like a lot. It's just hard for me to accept things. Me, like I get a little shy. Like I don't deserve it. Oh my god! <laughs> Give her a hug. <laughs> Give her a hug. <laughs> like, you need a hug. No. I appreciate everything with this video. Listen, you deserve it. You know why? Because you want to help your buddy. I'm gonna get emotional. I'm gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry on this episode. Mama's here. Mom's here. <laughs> so we have Diane here. Diane's gonna continue the rest of the story with us. So let's pop into your pop into your room. You don't think she's gonna tear up the carpet? We got her off Facebook for free, and it was from two college students. Part of me felt obligated to take the bunny just by the way the two college kids were acting. Um, they had all her stuff packed up, but when we got her and we got her home. She just was very, very aggressive. Mm -hmm. Like, no matter if we walked by her, she would charge us. I was asking the vet about it, and they said that animals are gonna remember being mean over being nice, so you, it's gonna be a while before she warms up. She said that she was in a cage, right? I think she was her. always just in the cage, and she was around dogs and a lot. Some, yeah, see, that can, that can cause her to be always have like a defense mechanism mm -hmm. because she's probably scared of the dogs mm -hmm. and also when you're just in a cage all the time it becomes the sanctuary unfortunately that's where the lunging comes from it's scared it definitely has to do with fear mm -hmm. so once we clear this out we can figure out where everything will go Way. <laughs> so, as usual, Small Pet Select has decided to gift you and your family and your bunny a ton of stuff. So you get Vitalicious Essentials, Healthy Snacks, you get litter, you're finally going to have litter, <laughs> Amazing. nail clippers, lots of toys. Oh wow. my goodness. She knows what it sounds that, like that. I don't even want her to eat this. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? She's like, cool. I want this in my oh, living room. I know. She's like, I want this in my living room. This is pretty That's, cool. She's gonna Look, and then you hang this oh, right wow. here. Let's actually put it together for her right now. This is nice. Thank you so much. We're gonna have to vacuum yeah. again. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hold it, babe. Wow, it's really hot in Oh! How much? What did I say? Okay. There. Oh. Okay. Are you guys ready to see your final room? Yes. Yes. We're Ooh, ready. Okay. So excited. You always have to get at their level. They're intimidated by people hovering above them or standing above them, okay? You just wanna lay down. You have a piece of banana? Yeah. So, okay, I'm just gonna put this right there. Oh, oh, oh. Pepper, come here. She smells it. She does. Here, she's, she's like a crack at her. She's like, yeah. That was she a hard it. thump. I'm so scared right now. Oh no, she just picked it up and now she's eating it. <laughs> I'm like trembling. <laughs> All right, so you just want to lay. If you just do this and you like read a book mm -hmm. around her, you don't have to do anything. Do not touch her. Don't do. Let her come to you. 
the important thing is she has to learn that you are not going to hurt her. Okay. She has to associate you with good things. That's why the banana is a great one. <laughs> but look at that. She's very comfortable around me now. But see, I'm not even attempting to touch her. Right. I'm just letting her investigate me and explore me. She's doing the same thing with you. You're just gonna you're just gonna sit here and don't move. Just place it right where it goes. And I just want you to do this a couple times a day, in the morning, in the evening. And while she's doing this, you can, you can slowly... They're not in danger. Right. <laughs> and then she's like just been racking her head about everything with Pepper. Yes, it's, I love, like, I love having her. It's just expensive or sometimes hard to come by when it's tight with money and stuff. So I appreciate everything you did in the video and of coming course. out here. Of course. When was the last time your room was? When we moved like in. <laughs> before, every, before I put everything in here, before the bed. <laughs> Yeah, about what you said earlier, you do deserve everything you have, and you should not be so hard on yourself, okay? Aww. Thank you. Hug it out, you <laughs> That's adorable. I was so happy when you even me back. She was. She was excited. And then I was like, wait a minute, she's going to come here for free? What? 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 What's the catch? And she's like, Mom, not everything, not everybody nowadays is going to, like, try and scare you. Aww. <laughs> But I really appreciate you coming out and talking to Brooke. Of course. Thank you so much. Of course. <laughs> You're so welcome. So Thank much. You. Thank Keep you. doing what you do, oh, okay? Oh. Keep coming out helped a ton and it just really opened my eyes to like that cage. Uh, my favorite part of the whole thing. I know. Destroying it. I loved it. And I can't wait to see the video when you post it. Thank you. Yeah. All right, thank you for saving Pepper as well. I forgot yes. to thank you for that. Because oh, a lot yeah. a lot of people would have given up on Pepper by now because she does nip. Even though she does bite and nip, and yes, I have scars from her, I love her so much. And yes, she does that, but I can't ever give her away. It's just my heart and my care for animals. I can't do that. Like, I know a lot of people are like, why can't you just give her away? Because my friends have even asked. I'm like, I can't. I feel so strongly bonded to her personally. Yeah, she does do that things, but it's better learning and bettering her behavior than just tossing her out and be like, nope, I'm not going to deal with it. Thank you for that message. And I really hope her audience learns from you because you're such a good example of what should really be done. So thank you for not giving up on her, for loving her. Keep, it was nice meeting keep you being both. a champion for animals and for bunnies. It was nice meeting you. Mwah.